Uh, 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 uh. So the traveling pundits are back. <laughs> Alright boys. Man like what's fine? Pundits. Oh yeah, cool boy. Yeah, right, let me show you some skills. Yeah, that's why I should be in the team. Man has a lead. Oh, 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 oh sign up, lad. Get sign me. Up. Shock that. What's that? It's the start traveling of the traveling pundits. What are you saying? Let's go. It's game day. Wexford here for the win again. Yeah, yeah, we match week 12 coming up against Guy, league leaders. The the game, and they gave me the ball, bro. <laughs> so, we're here to win from Irish Football Fan TV. So, what are your opinions going into today's game? Um, well, the way we're going at the moment, it's hard not to be confident. But obviously, you have a new manager and a bit of a bounce from that. So, I'd be fearful that he's my take to lead. But overall, I. I Finish. I expect Shells to finish strongly and get the win. Score prediction? Score prediction? Yeah. I'm going to go. I said these out in the car park earlier. I said 2 1, so I'm going to stick with that. I'm not going to change. Right. 2 1 to no Shells. No worries. Cheers for that, Paul. Much appreciated. No worries. <laughs> Saturday, Sunday, what? Sharp stuff at the start. Nice, nice, clean. And then as far as me. Open up. Second point. Open up the legs. Get straight. Come on, ten ball now. Let's go, Cruz. So, lads, um, you're the paramedic, right? We've been getting it wrong in our videos. Every time we come up, we do a bit of ambulance talk, and we say which team is going to end up in the ambulance by the end of the game. Right. <laughs> the boss is inside there, you can talk to him. Oh, Alright, <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's just in there, love the glasses. He, he, he's in there. He'll tell you who's gonna win, no matter. Right. Hey, right. Boss man, you're the, you're the man, you're the lead paramedic, right? We always do this thing called ambulance talk, right? Okay. We come up to the ambulance and we do a bit of discussion and then we decide who we think is going to end, end up in ambulance by the end of the game, right? Oh, no, man. And we always get it wrong. So we Good. need some professional uh, advice. Who do you reckon is going to win the game? Well, personally, I hope I threw the one win. Where the ambulance? Where the ambulance? Why the man body still right? Hey, 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 right. Right. Say right, don't I? Yeah, no. Yeah, I told right way. No, you're dead right then. Yeah. I think you're dead right. And today, with your luck, we'll push out running the ambulance. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna get them in there. <laughs> I don't have to happen anyway. Exactly. Fingers crossed. Cheers. Gentlemen, let's make moves. Come on, now, Mr. Stewart, give us some dancing. Oh. Oh. Nah, bro, I'm in business this time, bro. I'm in business. Oh. Score oh. predictions? Seriously, give us 6 2 to Wexford. 6 2? Of course. Come on. Second win of the season. Yeah, yeah. Guaranteed. You know. Uh huh. 4 1 Wexford. 4 1. Four one. Yeah, yeah. Jack Doherty, yeah. two goals. Cal Cavani, three goals. Mm, lurking a header. Back mm. goals. What are you saying? Mm. I'm going to announce the start in 11. There's only two changes to the start in 11. Mm. Just to keep it short and sweet, mm. Paul Fox is back from suspension, comes in to replace Charlie. And then it looks like the other change to the team as well. Um, Calfred Simmons comes in to replace Kevin McAvoy bear, from last bear, week's bear. game. Turn up. Wexford not quite able to clear their lines. Ali Gilchrist just wins the, um, the ball that bit too easily in the middle. Corner for Wexford, Connor Crowley. Into a super area. Oh, ricochets around dangerously. Huge appeals for a handball from the Wexford side. The referee's not interested. Let's watch the Shells delivery. That's much better. Oh, and it forces the save from Jimmy Corcoran. I think it... Oh, oh what a save. What a save. Jimmy. Jimmy is a motherfucking Gosh. spider. <laughs> okay, in my right. head I was in. Pressure is still on for Wexford. J.R. Wilson. It's going to come down to... Uh, Clear up, boys! Yeah. 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 
Okay. Oh. Where the ambulance? Where the ambulance? Why the man body still? Oh my days, bro. There was a fellow before them. Is it? Is it discreet? Is it discreet? It's calm. No, I'm not having that. Point in. Straight down the middle, and it's in the back of the net. Bad. Pretty much their best avenue. Oh, that's it. Come down for Kyle Robinson for the shot and just wide the far post. Guy, yeah, what do you think about that first oh. half? What do you want to think man. about that first half? Cool. Where do we even start? I think, first of all, that penalty was bullshit. That's no, what I think. There was a foul before that, 100%. Yeah, 100%. 100%. So, Rush should have called that. Yeah. Well, but it, was, it, was it was a pen. It was a pen. What? The foul should have been called before, before that. Before that. Sure. Yeah. Other than that. Mm -hmm. I think both sides were very even. Mm -hmm. I didn't see anyone dominating. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't even think that there's 24 points like different. Yeah, yeah, between the teams. Yeah. Yeah. You wouldn't yeah. think like Wexford are the team that have bottom. Well. If you watched yeah. this game and didn't know anything about League of Ireland and you watched the game the score and yeah. then you saw the table, you'd be in yeah. shock. You'd yeah. really be in shock. You'd be like, holy crap, the, like, the standard difference mm -hmm. isn't even like, isn't noticeable at all, to be honest. It, like, it could have yeah. been, it could have went either way, like, do you get me? Yeah. And it comes down to Georgie Poynton, O'Connor. Back to point, back to Michael O'Connor again. Switched out left, looking for Dale Rooney. Takes on the shot first time, decent effort. And the target, but Jimmy Corcoran was equal to it. Wins something there. Larkin, nice pass to Robinson. And back to Cleary. Manahan. Crowley. Extra playing with a much higher pace. And there's a chance for Crowley to take on the shot. And it's just about a yard wide. Well on, Jimmy! Hey, one. That's Mikey O'Connor. striker. So, what do you make of today's game? Uh, look, it was tough. We knew coming down here that we were going to sit off. Um, you know, and we were prepared for that all the week. We look forward to it. Yeah. Um, but in the end, we know we have and got us over the line. Exactly, and then so what you make of your start to the season? Then yeah, points look, on it's, the board. when you look at the team, like you know, it's it's well, more than likely that we can do that. You know, uh, not that you know we're stuck up our own arses or anything. You know, it's, it's the quality is there. The quality is there. You know, and when it clicks, um, it's frightening. Like you know, obviously tonight wasn't our best game, but look, three points coming down here, tough players to come. Ah, it's yeah. all that matters, really. Who will be? Second or third place, do you think your closest challenges? Because at the moment it looks like he's earning away with it. You see, yeah, look, we're just today. we're looking after ourselves. Like you know, I don't really care about anyone else but <laughs> Shelburne. Just you take know. out one game at the a rest time. of them can just keep chasing us. Uh, yeah. You know, we're not looking down the tail. We just take one game at a time. And yeah. who, who's coming up against next? Yeah, uh, we have Cork at home next, uh, which is going to be another tough game. You know, but well, yeah. we'll relax over the weekend and then we'll hit the ground running Monday, ready to go. Um, can you tell us a bit how the nickname Mr. Active came about? Uh, there's not much to it, lads. There's not much to it. Uh, it's just that every weekend I'm not in the house, so I'm always yeah. active. Ooh, I'm, always somewhere. I'm never sitting in the house. Yeah. You'll never find me sitting at home. Um, I'm always somewhere else doing something else, yeah. you know. That's why they call me Mr. Active. <laughs>